All right, hello again. Uh, Frank here with, uh, this is Thursday. Had carpal tunnel release surgery on my left hand on Tuesday. Doc said to take the bandage off today, or I could take the bandage off today, which I'm really wanting to do because it feels kind of itchy under there. Uh, I'm able to move my fingers a little bit better, a, bit, a little bit better of a fist. Uh, can bend my hand back a little bit. In this way, just touching my fingers together, still a little bit kind of painful to do the pinky and the thumb, but uh, only had uh, pain relieving medication the first day, so wasn't too painful, wasn't terribly uncomfortable. I mean, it's kind of been a little achy, but uh, I guess that's to be expected. I uh, don't like taking stuff, but uh, anyway, here we go. Just wanted to have you guys check this out. For anybody who may be suffering from carpal tunnel, if you're a musician or I guess anybody, but especially a musician as, as I am, you wanna kinda know what to expect. I didn't really know what to expect, so anyway, this is for you. Uh, for anybody considering this type of surgery. So anyway, here's the underlying gauze, lace bandage, all right. Let's see, where is the, where, where's the end? Ah, here we go. All right. We're going to see what it looks like here. And uh, you're going to see it at the same time as me. All right, well, here we go. There you are, just a, a little small incision underneath here. Doc said these will probably come off in a few days. There's some of the doctors writing. Uh, just to, I don't know if you can see that or not, like an arrow and just making sure that this is uh, the correct hand to work on. But, oh, you can see just a little swelling in there. Swelling in here. Almost a little bit of bruising, perhaps. But, it doesn't hurt to, to touch. So the, the actual, sorry about that, the actual um, ligament that they cut that goes over the carpal tunnel is, is right in this area. So they come up through here and then go into the carpal tunnel, kind of dilate it with a dilator and then have like a little from within. So there's not a big scar here and scar tissue and adhesions. But um, anyway, so I'm, I'm looking forward to, to being able to get my playing back up and running here, but it's feeling a lot better. All right, here's the mandolin test. Ah, oh, look, even gripping the mandolin now, all right. Oh, that was the hard one yesterday. surgery already. I will say still having some numbness in my index finger and uh, this finger and that may be due to the swelling but that's what I've been feeling mostly from since uh, Thanksgiving and it is now March um, 29th. So surgery was on March 27th and now it's March 29th 2018. But hopefully that swelling will go down and relieve some of that numbness that's in, in these fingers still. All right, there you go. The latest update.